hype. That, that game was hype. <laughs> Tell them. You and Dana Hayes, you were popping. Exactly. Oh my god. <laughs> and one. You might have to teach me that one. You like into three in the range. Three, I gotta work on my mid range. Come off the screen. Play with them. I'm gonna pull up. Good. Good, good, good. Give me one. Good shot. My role model is definitely my parents and God. I think with all the God-given abilities that he's given me, I just try to glorify his name. And then my parents raised me pretty well to just be a great person first, and then basketball comes after that. Bounce. Good. Paige Becker's Film School, Field by Gatorade, and I'm joined here by Paris Park. What makes like a New York Hooper like? Um, definitely our swag. I feel like we got a different type of swag. Um, when you step on the court, it's like nobody can guard us. We play like I feel like people from New York, which is different. Like not a lot of people are like us, so it's like it's just like the vibe is like it's crazy. Like people like Rucker Park, Dykeman, like you have people there like screaming, banging on the bleachers and stuff. So it's really a vibe. Like you're not gonna get that anywhere else for real. Yeah, I wanna. I have yet to play. Really? In New York, yeah. It's definitely a vibe for sure. All right, let's watch the <laughs> film. How would you describe your game? I like to play fast, aggressive. Yeah, you're fast, for sure. Has there like been a time in life where you had to like overcome adversity, overcome a challenge? Yeah, um, I feel like all the time, especially like being one of the top players in my class, it's always like, you always hear something about yourself, like she can't do this, she shouldn't be getting this, but it's just, it makes me know like I'm doing something right. Is that how you deal with it? Like, yeah. using this motivation? Right, like if you got no haters, you would pop in. Exactly. Yeah. That's how I feel. Because, <laughs> boy, then do I have yeah. a lot, for sure, so. It's just motivation. Yeah. I feel like Michael Jordan, all the great sad haters, so. For sure, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That, that game was hype. What was that? That game was, we played Carolina Flames that game. Uh, that was hype. You like into three mid range? Three, I gotta work on my mid range. I think it's a really crucial part of college basketball, so let's go upstairs and show you something. When I'm coming off these screens, I like to play with the defender on my back a little bit just so I can get him out of the play. Come off the screen, play with him, and then pull up. You got it. Cash. Cash. Easy. So like going from like high school to college, like what was the biggest like adjustment that you had to make? I think, like the speed and the attention Good. to details was the biggest thing for me. In high school, a lot of stuff that I did, I was just like, Good. come, yeah. give me Good. a ball screen and then just went from there. But I, I feel like college basketball is just so much more particular and you just gotta pay attention yeah. more to the details. Good. Pull quick. Good. Good Who's the toughest person you've had to guard? <laughs> guard anybody? Yeah. <laughs> If you want to be the greatest, then you got to study the greats. That means countless hours in the film room, studying our role models that paved the way, and following in their path to greatness. It doesn't matter where you're from or what you look like. You, too, have the power within to overcome anything. Gatorade. Fuel tomorrow. Back in my bag and I gotta I'm Paige Beckers with Tania Latson, and we're here with Gatorade Film School. Oh my gosh, <laughs> and one. You might have to teach me that move. You gotta teach me how to come off them screens like you, girl. <laughs> Why you wear double zero? Um, I mean, in the uh, AAU, sixth grade, I lived in Hawaii, and my coach was like, oh, you like double agent zero, James <laughs> Bond, so I just kept it ever since. That's cool, that's a, that's a cool little story. Yeah. Who do you like model your game after? Um, I wouldn't say LeBron. I kind of play bully ball a lot. So like big guard? Mm-hmm. 
Hello. That's what I like. So when you're playing, watching the highlight tapes, like what do you hope younger girls take from your game? I hope younger girls take my defense. I mean, that's a lost art, honestly, especially with today's world. I mean, offense is such a big thing now. Um, definitely defense, just playing hard, getting your teammates involved, and just being a team player and a leader. What's your next big goal in basketball? Definitely to win a national championship in college. Um, I just want to accomplish that before I make it to the league. I feel like that's a good accomplishment, and um, every girl wants to do that. So we'll be competing for it? For sure. For sure. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> and one. So you got a little shifty. Yeah, you got a little shiftiness. So you're heading to Florida State. I know that you want to work on some ball screens that you're going to need in college, so let's go off and work on it. Let's do it. All right, so obviously, like I said, college basketball, got to be able to use ball screens. I'm going to do it as if, like, they're in drop coverage mm -hmm. and the guard is going to be trailing me. So I'm going to just, like, play with him a little bit mm -hmm. on my back. Mm -hmm. I'm going to call screen. And I'm going to look at them. And I'm going to see where they're at. And then, depending on that, I'm going to probably just pull up with the defenders. OK. All right, but I'm going to actually pull up, though. Alright. There's a lot of different reads that I like to look at. Mm -hmm. For me, if I know the screen is coming, I'm obviously I'm gonna set it up, right? Right. But I'm looking at the defender's eyes, because if they look even like for a split second mm -hmm. at the screen, I'm just gonna reject it. Yeah. You know. So you say come off. Yeah, there. Just like that. There you go. You be getting hyped? Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. Especially on N1s. N1s is crazy. The layup package, like who do you take that from? Cause you got oh, nice no. little layup package. I just like, I'm so athletic, so I just be like looking at John Morant, of course. Yeah. Cause nice. he just be floating. Cause he got air time. Yeah. <laughs> so definitely yeah, there him. you go. Definitely him. Oh yeah. <laughs> What's your favorite celebration? Just that right there. <laughs> So you won Florida Gatorade Player of the Year. How did that feel? Amazing. I mean, I almost cried. That was the only like award I actually cried about because um, I've dreamed about it since I was little. So it was just a, a good accomplishment for me. Did you cry or did you almost cry? I cried. <laughs> I cried too. How does it feel handling all that pressure? It's a lot. It really is. Like just the pressure and all these expectations being put on you, but at the same time, I have such high expectations for myself. Right. So I just try to prove myself right. You can't please everybody, you so can. everybody is yeah. going to say something. There's always going to be haters, always going to be doubters. Yeah. And so I'm trying not to focus on that because no matter what I do, they're always going to say something. So just making sure like, I have a really tight circle, um, just having those right voices around me mm -hmm. and making sure that the people I care about, making them happy and proving them right and proving myself right first, so. I'm Paige Beckers with Tanaya Latson, and that's it for Gatorade Film School. Peace. Overtime Fits keeps blessing me with all these fits and you can cop them too. Head over to the OT shop and peat some of these new drops. All you gotta do is click the link below.